10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, all across this boys and world, oh yeah, we back, Kirk Knight on the beat, Brooklyn, have a safe summer, pro era, we out here, rest in peace my nigga Steve, it's for you, summer nights. What do I have to do? What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. My name is Evan. Some people call me Evo. Currently, I'm back home in Kansas City. Today is December 31st, New Year's Eve. I can't believe the year has gone by this fast. Is it just me, or does it seem like every year is getting shorter and shorter? This year, 2022, has probably been the best year of my life. I got to travel around Europe, make memories with my girlfriend, and move to an island. Plus, start this YouTube channel where I get to share all my memories and all my greatest moments with you all. So in this video, I just want to reflect over this past year, scroll through my camera roll month by month, and show you guys some of my favorite moments that happened this year. With that being said, let's start the video. 2022 started off in Paris, the city of crepes and romance, as you can see here. This was my first time in the city, so I wanted to hit all the touristy spots. I learned that the Mona Lisa really, it's, it's not all that. Spent New Year's Eve in Paris, really struggled trying to open this bottle of champagne here. Got to party with some rich Parisians. And then randomly got asked to do a photo shoot which turned out pretty cool. February came around and we decided to buy a 15 euro flight to Turin, Italy. Shout out to Ryanair. American Airlines could never. Ate literally some of the best Italian food I've ever had in my life. And discovered probably the most talented street performer in the country of Italy. In March, we hopped around southern Spain in our car, drank some bomb Moroccan tea, and explored the beautiful city of Granada. Also got to ball up on some Spaniards. They hated me after this one. April was kind of a rough month. We nearly escaped death by getting in a car wreck where our car flipped over three times. This is the damage. All I have to say is, God is good. But after that, we got some much needed recuperation on the island of Mallorca. And danced flamenco with some strangers. In May, my parents came to visit me in Granada. I said goodbye to my students in my first year of teaching. So what is one thing that you think that you have learned from me this year? How to express my English. Okay, how to express your English, very good. I'm glad I can help you with that. <laughs> Celebrated my 24th birthday. And also shot and released the first video on my YouTube channel. June was probably the hottest month of my life. But we made the most of it by staying in a cabin in the mountains for a couple days, just to reconnect with nature. And we ended up finding this amazing, very powerful waterfall. In July, I met up with my boy Anthony for the start of our two week, three country tour around Europe. We started in Barcelona, went to a crazy concert the first night and danced with some strangers. What's Wait. up YouTube? In Amsterdam, we ate Stroop waffles and old cheese, took a ferry to a party and met some crazy Americans in the red light district. Shout out Daniel, AKA Sexy Boy. 
A trip in Europe wouldn't be complete without seeing Paris. Since I've been there before, I decided to take Anthony to all the cool spots. Ended up seeing Peyton Manning trying to go incognito in the Louvre. You're not slick, bro. You're not slick. The next night, we ended up going to this wild party at a fire station. Spent 45 euros on a bottle of champagne for no reason. We ended the Euro trip on Bastille Day in front of the Eiffel Tower and caught an epic fireworks show. In August, we moved to the beautiful Canary Islands, hung out next to the third largest volcano in the world, and adjusted to our new home. In September, my brother Austin came to visit. The first thing I did was take him to get some bomb island food. He showed me some cool dance moves and how to do a perfect front flip. I came out of track and field retirement to dust these boys off in a race. And we finished off the trip just vibing in this empty club. October came around and I started back on my hooping grind. I still got a little bit of bounce left in me. Went on some incredible hikes with my girl. I swear she loves me. Finally experienced my first nude beach. Naturally, I had to participate. I mean, when in Spain, right? This month, I played in my first amateur league game. Went snorkeling for the first time. Built friendships with some really cool people. And went to a really interesting rap concert. We started off the month of December by renting this little red Fiat and zipping around the island. Going to one of the most beautiful beaches in Tenerife. But unfortunately, seeing a dead whale that washed up on shore. Rest in peace, Oscar. You'll be severely missed. Caught the most amazing sunset of my life with Mount Teide in the background and a couple friends. All before making it back to Kansas for a home cooked meal and to spend Christmas time with my family. If you made it to the end of this video, I just want to say thank you. I appreciate you. I love you. I hope to do more crazy stuff, make more memories in 2023. If you guys enjoyed this video, please, 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 don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment. Don't forget to send me a cash out, whatever you want to do. Sending all you guys love, light, and blessings in the new year.